while I work on the next video, which will take a while because of the testing I have to do. I thought we'd do something a bit lighter. Here's 10 things that we all do that we shouldn't do in 3D printing. Let's go. Printing while something else is already on the bed. This is especially a problem if you manage your printer remotely like I do with Octoprint. Preheating and walking off. You've done it, I've done it, we've all done it. Once, once I even went to bed, I woke up next day and my Ender 3 was still on and still preheated. I'm sure some printers have timeouts, but apparently not all of them. Number three, slicing and printing without supports turned on. I don't think I need to explain this one, but always check the preview tab. Number four, using the wrong material settings in the slicer. Honourable mention also here to using the wrong bed temperature for a glass bed. That never works. Number five, ordering the wrong size PLA filament. Number six, snapping the filament in the hot end when you're trying to change it. This is actually a tip too. When Marlin changes filament, you'll notice that it pushes it forward a bit before it pulls it backwards. You should do the same, because this avoids a huge nugget of filament that you have to then drag backwards through the PTFE tube. Number seven, changing nozzle and forgetting to level the bed. Sometimes you might get away with it, but Mostly not. Number eight, touching the hot parts of the printer when they're actually hot. Number nine, buying one 3D printer and thinking that it will be enough. And the all-time number 10, um, wait a minute, we've done this backwards, huh? but the biggest mistake that we all make and we never learn from is walking off before the first layer is complete. And yet we still all do it. There you go. Do you do any of those? Comment below. The answer's obviously yes, but comment anyway. I will see you in the next video. Here's kind of thing I'm going to be doing, but we'll see how that goes. Thank you for watching.